lot of houses are gone. A lot of people don't have houses, they don't have food, they don't have water. Uh, the supplies we're bringing them to are, are crucial, and the more supplies we get, the faster we get, the better it's going to be for them. And right now our main focus is to deliver supplies, push out tents, foods, tarps, to help the police people in the most destroyed regions of Nepal right now. Uh, we're all sharing this space, we're all coordinating together to work in this tiny space uh, efficiently. As far as the Nepalese army, they are escorting us every flight, pointing out LZs, providing crucial routes while we're flying. Nepalese pilots are out there helping us with radio calls and stuff like that. It feels really great to be a part of AID. I've always wanted to help people my entire life, and it's such a difference seeing it firsthand. The Nepalese are very thankful, they're very polite, very nice people. So being able to go to these zones, drop it off, having all these smiles and people helping you, seeing them be thankful for the help that we're providing, it's a fantastic experience and I wouldn't trade it for the world.